Compass Airlines, LLC, is a regional airline headquartered in Delta Air Lines Building C at Minneapolis-St. Paul International Airport in Fort Snelling, Hennepin County, Minnesota. Prior to December 16, 2009, it was headquartered in unincorporated Fairfax County, Virginia, United States, east of the Chantilly CDP. The airline launched inaugural service with a single Bombardier CRJ-200LR aircraft under the Northwest Airlink now Delta Connection brand between Minneapolis, St. Paul and Washington, D.C. on May 2, 2007. On August 21, 2007, it began flying two Embraer 175-76 passenger aircraft, and expanded to 36 aircraft by December 2008. In July 2010, the airline was purchased from Delta Air Lines and became a wholly owned subsidiary of Trans States Holdings. This airline is the only remaining airline of the former Northwest Group. History Compass Airlines was formed as a result of a contract dispute between Northwest Airlines and its pilots' union, the Airline Pilots Association The Northwest Airlines pilot group was asked to give relief on a section of their collective bargaining agreement governing scope which protects pilot jobs by ensuring that an airline's customers are flown by the employees of that airline. The pilots eventually agreed to a concession on the scope of their contract allowing a limited number of 76-seat aircraft to be flown by outsourced pilots working for a subcontractor regional airline. In exchange for their concession the Northwest Airlines pilots demanded in return that the pilots of these new aircraft would eventually flow up into mainline pilot jobs at Northwest Airlines, and that Northwest Airlines pilots would retain the ability to «flow down» into the newly subcontracted pilot jobs in the event that Northwest Airlines were to furlough the mainline pilots. In order to adapt to the agreement, and fulfill a need to serve the regional markets with smaller, more efficient aircraft and a dramatically reduced wage labor force, Northwest bought the operating certificate of bankrupt Independence Air on March 10, 2006 for $2 million. During the concept phase, the subsidiary was known as NUCO. Compass operations are limited to 76-seat aircraft or less, due to the language in the pilot contract at the mainline carrier. On September 28, 2006, Compass Airlines officially received approval from the United States Department of Transportation to begin operations. On April 5, 2007, Compass Airlines received FAA certification to begin commercial passenger operations with a CRJ 200 on May 2, 2007. The airline had their first revenue flight from Washington Dulles International Airport to Minneapolis minus St. Paul International Airport, which maintained the operating certificate. Compass implemented Embraer operations on August 21, 2007. On July 1, 2010, Delta Air Lines announced that it sold Compass Airlines to Trans States Holdings for $20.5 million. Despite the change in ownership, Compass still shares many things with their former parents, including the pre-merger Northwest Online Crew Scheduling Software Radar, headquarters in a Delta-owned building, and a logo that is a modified version of the final Northwest Airlines logo. On March 27, 2015, the airline began flying one of 20 brand new Embraer E-175, operating for American Airlines under the American Eagle airline brand, with the initial flight being from Los Angeles International Airport to Houston Intercontinental Airport. Compass has its maintenance bases in Phoenix, San Jose, Los Angeles, San Francisco, and Seattle, Tacoma. Destinations 
Topic crew bases Los Angeles, American Eagle and Delta Connection Phoenix, Delta Connection Seattle, Tacoma, Delta Connection Topic. Fleet As of June 2018, the Compass Airlines fleet consists of the following aircraft. Topic. Labor relations Both the pilot and flight attendant groups are unionized, with pilots being represented by the Airline Pilots Association, and flight attendants represented by the Association of Flight Attendants. The flight attendants negotiated and approved a five-year contract with the company on May 1, 2013, following a failed vote on a tentative agreement in late 2011. The new contract gave employees pay increases, a larger 401k match, a signing bonus, and other working condition improvements. On August 25, 2010, Compass Airlines fired a flight attendant after she appeared on a local television program admitting publicly that she qualified for food stamps, even though she was a full-time employee of the airline. Incidents On May 8, 2008, Compass Airlines Flight 2040 bound for Regina, Saskatchewan from Minneapolis with 74 passengers and four crew on board was forced to land in Fargo, North Dakota after a fire broke out in the restroom. The plane landed at 11 p.m., no injuries to passengers were reported. A week after the incident, a 19-year-old flight attendant was charged with starting the fire. He pleaded not guilty, but before trial, he fled to Mexico. He was arrested in Mexico April 5, 2011, and was extradited to the U.S. to stand trial. He was sentenced to seven years in prison on December 16, 2011. On November 15, 2010, Compass Airlines Flight 5887 bound for Missoula, Montana from Minneapolis with 76 passengers and four crew on board was forced to return to Minneapolis after the aircraft received substantial damage when it collided with a flock of birds. The plane landed 22 minutes after departure, no injuries to passengers were reported. <laughs> 